Hello, Facebook. Ooh. Sorry, I'm a little late. I know I said I was going to come on at noon, but um, I forgot how to do Facebook Live, so I had to find it. Actually, I had to Google it, and then I had to find it. So, got one person watching. Hi, Angela. This is um, this is a hornet's nest in the background here. So just waiting on a couple more people to join before I get started. I'm gonna take this little thing off. Whoa, hello. Oh, oh. All right, we've got eight people on. So I'll get started here. Can I get a thumbs up if you can hear me okay? I've got Dylan's contraptions going on my phone here. It's like a like ABC Live on location. All right, thanks for the thumbs up. Okay, so um, for those of you who have been alive in the past week, you know that there's been some fires in Napa and um, it has caused quite a bit of damage, displaced a lot of our friends and family and business owners and wineries. And um, we spent the weekend, my husband and I and family and friends out supporting the economy and going to these amazing restaurants. And we got some amazing VIP service because it's, hold on, let me take this thing off. I have this, thank you Dillhole, but it made me look like an alien. Um, we got some amazing VIP service. We're in the height of uh, tourist season right now. So usually September, October, November is when we have more visitors than Disneyland. And we went out this weekend and it was a ghost town and it, it made me really sad. It hurt my heart. It made me think, you know, as a local business owner, you know, what can I do to help bring tourism back? And I don't think that there's much I can personally do, but I'm going to try anyways. So I got to thinking, you know, what would bring people into town? Um, and, and all I could think about was like, oh my gosh, VIP service, restaurants, wineries, hotels, like they are all ready, willing, eager to please. So what we decided to do as the Slory Group, as a local business owner, is to do a giveaway. So I'm calling it a getaway giveaway. So I am giving away a three day, two night stay here in Napa, all inclusive, all expenses paid, every possible thing that you can think of to do in Napa, wine tasting, private Pilates session, breakfast, lunch, and dinner, um, the, the local experience. Um, so all you have to do to enter to win, super easy, and it's kind of um, a, a, a dual thing here. So all you have to do to enter to win is make a $25 donation to our GoFundMe account. And what that GoFundMe account is going to do is we're going to donate all of the monies that we earn um, to the victims of the fire. So I personally am giving away the two night stay in the hotels. We've already got some amazing local business owners on board to give away um, breakfast at Alexis Baking Company. We've got Bistro Gianti on board. We've got Jessup Sellers on board for wine tastings. We're working on some really exciting things. So all you have to do, and I'll put the link below, is where's it at? It's in Napa. What do you mean where it's at? It's in Napa. Um, so we're doing all kinds of stuff, giving away um, a jam-packed three-day Napa experience for anyone, um, for one lucky winner. So it's it's for two people, but one lucky winner. And every time you donate $25, you get entered to win. So we're going to be running this giveaway for two weeks. And during that two weeks, we're actually going to be going around Link Sucka. I know, I'm trying to link it up. I, Dude, you're lucky I figured out how to turn Facebook Live on in the first place. How am I supposed to link it up and talk? Um, so every for every day that we're running this, it's going to be two weeks till November 6th. On November 6th, we're going to be announcing the winner. And during that time period, we're actually going to be going around to these local businesses, and we're going to be interviewing these local business owners about what they love about the Napa Valley, why they think that you should come visit us, even if you don't win, why you should come visit us, and what they would do if they were a tourist. So all of these amazing local business owners who's contributing to this giveaway are going to have the opportunity to tell you guys 
why you should come to the Napa Valley. So please enter. I'm going to put the link in as soon as I turn Facebook Live if off, if I can actually figure out how to do that. And please donate, share, share this video, share that GoFundMe. Get as many people as you can to enter because it's going to be like the best Napa Valley experience anyone can enjoy because we're actually getting advice from locals on what they would do if they were a tourist. And so that's three days, two nights here in Napa. Um, questions? Anybody got questions? Anybody want to donate anything? Contact me. I'm at 707-486-5400. And um, contact me if you're interested as a local business owner to contribute to this. It's going to be super exciting. And remember, anyone in the world can enter for this. So literally, we're paying for you to come to the Napa Valley and experience everything that it has to offer. Um, the film festival is coming up as well. Yes, thank you, Jason. I'm a projectionist. Stromsburg, thanks, Chris. That's awesome. Stromsburg is like the best champagne. Don't tell mom I said that, but it's like the best champagne ever. You don't even need to put orange juice in it. It's so good. Um, so anyways, I am going to um, put the link below. And like I said, I'm going to start a list of all of the uh, giveaways that we're going to be doing. And tomorrow, I'm actually going to be live on location. Listen, I sound like a correspondent. Live on location with one of our um, donors. And that's going to be Bistro Gianti and uh, Jessup Seller. So I'm going to be trekking up to Yauntville. And um, who is that giving me so many thumbs up? That's distracting as all hell. Um... So Alexis Baking Company, for those of you that don't know, it's one of the best breakfasts in Napa. Uh, Bistro Gianti, Andaz, um, did I say that right? Andaz, Andaz? I'm a local and I still don't know how to say it. I think it's one of those things that like some people say it one way, some people say it the other way, potato, potato. Um, Chris is going to try to get us Stromsburg tasting. Jeremy Forcier has donated the Venters Collective. Um, I've got a private yoga session with one of my yoga instructors. So really, really exciting stuff, guys. So please share this video, share the GoFundMe that I'm going to put the link below as soon as I figure out how to turn Facebook Live off and make this something really exciting. So it's only $25 to enter, 25 bucks. Our goal is to raise $5,000 in donations. And remember, this is 100% donated. Every dollar, every cent that we raise, we're going to be donating to those fire victims. So please, please make a donation. Um, I can donate a knife and a tomahawk. Awesome. So Josh works at a store where you can actually go and um, throw tomahawks. So for those of you that don't know that, there is a store up Valley where you can go and hang out and play with knives. What, what boy doesn't want to play with knives? So thank you for that donation, Josh, on Dawes. Thank you. Thanks, Jennifer. On Dawes. So lots and lots of opportunities for you guys to win. $25. So if you donate $1,000, how many entries is that? I'm like super bad with math. 250 that gives you um, the new West Knife Works. Thanks, Joel. So you guys share this video. Thank you for joining me. Say goodbye to my hornet's nest. Um, I look forward to seeing all of you guys contribute, and I'm excited for the interviews coming up this week. If you guys know of any local business owners that want to contribute, let me know. And here I go seamlessly stopping my Facebook.